To fight against food deserts in Jacksonville today, Councilman Reginald Gaffney announced a new Winn-Dixie is coming to the Gateway Shopping Center in the Brentwood area. The Winn-Dixie will replace the Publix, which is set to close three days after Christmas. On your side, Ken Amaro spoke with Councilman Gaffney about what this means for the community. The final chapter of this Publix here in Gateway has been written, but there's a new chapter for another grocery store. And last night, City Council took action to make it happen. When Dix want to be here, and we, so I'm working on that. City Councilman Reginald Gaffney greeted last minute Thanksgiving shoppers, telling them when Dixie is coming to Brentwood. How often do you make your trip here to the parks? Like twice a week. Twice a week. Mm -hmm. So when you learned that they were leaving, what was your thoughts? Your I was sad. Gaffney wants his constituents to know he's working to fill the gap. I introduced the bill for $850,000 of uh, when Dix is to move into this particular location. The bill was introduced as an emergency at Tuesday's city council meeting. We want to get this store open as quick as we can. The money, he says, is from the Northwest Jacksonville Economic Development Fund, an effort to fight against food deserts. My colleagues recognize that this will be a food desert, it will be a crisis. Gaffney says the $850,000 will be used to improve the infrastructure for the new store, a new roof, new AC system, renovation, and parking lot improvements. We're going to try to do whatever we can as a, a, a city and as leaders to speed this process up. So the new timeline for the Winn-Dixie here at the Gateway Shopping Center is going to be around late January, early February. And the councilman told me that those who are now working here will have the opportunity to work with the new store. In Gateway, Canamero, First Coast News, on your side.